Today in our 2015 GMC Acadia, we will be testing the Swagman Trailhead. That's part number S63380. Uh, it's a tilting bike rack and it holds uh, four bikes and uh, it can be used for inch and a quarter or two inch hitches. So we can go ahead and start by inserting our shank into our receiver. We'll go ahead and line our pinholes up. And we'll take our anti-rattle bolt and we can go ahead and start threading that through. All right, once we get that threaded, we can go ahead and take our socket wrench and tighten that the rest of the way down. And by tightening this up, it's gonna help reduce the play and the rattle within our hitch. So the nice thing about the uh, anti-rattle bolt there Give that a quick shake. As you can see, most of the uh, rattle is reduced. Put our clip on, and then we can go ahead and take a few measurements. All right, starting with our nearest point, that's going to be about two and a half inches from here to our bumper. Now, overall, we've added about 22 inches to our vehicle. And for our ground clearance back here, about 20 and a half inches. All right, this bike rack does have that tilt feature, so I'll go ahead and show you that. So you want to come up here to this uh, black knob, go ahead and untighten that, and you want to turn this vertical, then remove your pin and clip. As you can see, that allows it to tilt out. And that allows us to get into our rear hatch to remove any cargo, gear, or groceries we may have with us. All right, now to put that back in place, it's pretty simple. Just pick it back up, align your pinholes, replace your clip, and then you can go over here, turn this horizontal. It acts as a locking device for our center mast. It also helps tighten it up to reduce the play when our bike is mounted and we're driving down the road. So we'll tighten that up. As you can see, give that a quick shake. It's pretty solid. All right, so we can go ahead and raise up our arms the way you do that is come up here to this pin and clip. Go ahead and remove those. Raise up the arms. Align the pin holes. Put your clip in place. And by raising up the arms, we have added about 36 inches to our vehicle. All right, now we can go ahead and undo our straps and grab our bike. All right, now that we've got our bike, we'll come up over the cradles. Get it seated where we want it. As you can see, I'm adjusting the cradles here. I want it to fit my bike best. It's a nice feature for the bike rack there. All right, once we've got that in the position that we want it, we'll go ahead and do our anti-sway strap first. This is going to help reduce the sway in our bike while we're driving down the road. All right, then we'll come over to our top. All right, and then finally our last two here. All right, and then our bike is secure. That's going to complete our test fit of the Swagman Trailhead Tilting 4 Bike Rack, part number S63380, on our 2015 GMC Acadia. Let's see how that bike rack did on our test course. 